I, th I think I think season one Gara, one of the coolest characters ever exists. And then he got soft. But all right, here we go. Winners finals: Cameras versus Noku. Is that spin dash? I don't think Squirtle's it, by the way. I think that Squirtle's buttons are a little stubby. A little too stubby. I think. I like think, I think Sonic. I think uh, Mario's stubby, but he can still deal with Sonic pretty fine. I think Squirtle's just too stubby. Because by that point, Sonic's already in where he wants to be anyway. Well, Mario also has no no choices, right? Like Mario can't be like, "Yo, what if I just turned into Luigi real You're quick?" You're right. Like, exactly. <laughs> yeah, I think but, Ivysaur is the is the money maker on this one. Either that or Zard. I think Zard can deal with Sonic pretty pretty well, actually. Zard Zard may not have the speed to deal with Sonic, but the big buttons can catch him uh, sleeping. You see Noku do the Noku hold S smash that ledge. Yes. That is uh, trademark, by the way. Every time you do it, you owe him money. Oh. He was. He hung up I don't know if he was ready for the Pokemon switch or if that was a reaction. Either way, it killed. Yeah. It worked. I saw Kamek's kill with. F smash dangled down at ledge and it was completely safe too. I was like, Sonic can do that? No. I love how you do I love how Kamix is really good at making you guess whether he's gonna commit to a spin dash or not. I think you really need to just play like center stage with Ivysaur and I think yeah. that's how how the matchup you don't really want to go off stage against him because you're not you're not you don't have the tools to win that especially with I mean unless you have the down air and you're in position for it Sonic is a, a little too fast whenever he wants to come back to ledge he can be really safe about it too yeah you definitely like win if you guess right obviously but like yeah. when you guess wrong he gets center stage yep like immediately <laughs> it's better off to just keep your advantage in neutral uh, let's see let's see Amex showing that he really Wow, nice tag. No, it was, it was good armor on Nick. He, he, Noku waited for Kamax to be on him, ready to hit a button, because the armor's only on the startup of Charizard's up yep. Same thing, waited for the spring so that he could armor through it instead of getting clipped. Noku really needs to find short work of the stock so he can maybe get yeah. some extra credit here. Forward air, not gonna kill, he traded. Yeah, that's cross stage, not gonna do it just yet. 188, F tilt takes it. I actually really like the idea of uh, him using flamethrower to slow it down there, but I feel like he had to mash another button after. Yep. Water gun's gonna, gonna do it. No jump. Nope. No jump and your Sonic. No upbeat. And they spin dash at each other. Kamek showing that he actually knows the matchup pretty well. Yeah, I'm surprised he didn't go for a tech there. Maybe he option selected on the tech, but I wouldn't have known whether or not that Squirtle Upbeat was going to make me tech or not. Yeah. Oh, he caught him with the back air. He he, tra All right. he tracked the Squirtle side we in and countered right, with the back air. Noku's really got to think about what went wrong in that last game because it kind of seemed like he was just rack Camus was just racking a percent out of nowhere, and then all of a sudden you're at a way higher percent. You're like, wait, I only got hit by like one dash attack. Well, here's step one. Step one, take him to a smaller stage where yeah, you your can't give him the room to run away like you, the, your button can control those dashes. more of like yeah. Small battlefield. No, nah, it's not a Smashville. But still, it's still an improvement. Although Kamex is saying, it doesn't matter where you take me, I'm still too fast. Yeah, I, I really like the ability to hide under the platform when he's been dashing high. Yes. Oh, he tried to give him with up here. It almost worked. I, was, I like the aggression. Even though he knew he was above Ivysaur, he said, I'm just going to go in before he can up there. Spin dash. Up beat through the stage. Yeah. yeah, I think it's slowing it down with these these race loops kinda like limit his options. I mean he's still gonna find his way. 
But yeah, I like what you're saying about the uh, Razor Leaf limiting the options. Because, again, he might have still gotten it, but it made him approach in a very linear fashion. He yeah. just had to run across he, the he ground. Ha he had to go horizontal. Down there? Oh, Ooh, just barely. Oh, he missed? That was mad good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, feel, I thought it was going to be tether cancel like Nair, but that's way better. Yeah, down, down there definitely hits different. Yeah, I wasn't sure whether or not the down arrow connected, so I thought he was just gonna go for like the kind of guarantee put the hitbox there. Yeah, but you gotta remember, you gotta remember what he's going up against. It's Sonic. Sonic doesn't want to be that far away from the stage for too long. Yeah, yeah, he has to hold in otherwise, because yep. no, with no jump, he wouldn't be able to exactly. up. Yeah, yeah. He knew exactly where he was gonna be. Oh, but on that up, he had his number. Yeah. And we're back to season one, Ivysaur. nerfed. I heard, right? Yeah, it's uh, lost since one. Yeah, uh, that vine whip used to kill stupid oh, yeah. early. No up air? Up air's not gonna connect though. Yo, it would have actually been sick if he landed on its spring. <laughs> <laughs> he did that before actually, this. The spring was on the ground. He went for a down air just in case uh, someone came at him and he bounced off the spring and kept his momentum for a spin dash. I was like, oh, okay, Kamex. It'd have been funny if uh, Noku hit the, the first Ivy up air, landed on the spring, and then up aired again. That'd have been not okay. Nice air dash. I would have been upset, actually. I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> it's a good nair. Back here, not quite going to do it. This on Kamex to make, make the... Oh, good up B, though. He's gotten him almost every single time with the spring. Yeah. Also, I will say, Cam I, really like, down uh, here, yeah. I really like how Kamex makes use of the action, being able to act after up the Sonic. There's the, the patented, the one, the, the only. No the Nicholas Goku, my man. Just, <laughs> I mean, that had to be like, like the earliest. I don't think he let go. <laughs> That's I, what that I'm had saying. to be the That's earliest let time, go of Every Every time no Noku does that, everybody's like, don't. That, that's like frame one. There's no way he's nah. got that. It, it's really good because it's, it's a scary option because from that spacing, you can't roll. You, you definitely can't roll. Yeah. You can't neutral get up. Exactly. You, can't, you can't get up attack because it's far enough back that you can't do it. Well, and the only option is jump, and he it's safe even if you jump. Yeah, and if you jump too late, he'll still hit you. It'll hit. And he's, he, he like delays it just a second to hold for the timing where... And then he gets you like first frame of vulnerability. Yeah, where your vulnerability is running out. Yep. You're like, wait, I'm dead? That hit? Kamex off stage. Immediately gets back. Like you said before, he's able to just, if you let Sonic get past, you just immediately take center stage back and is back in the driver's seat. Ooh, very good catch on the up there, though. Air, yeah. That forward air barely not hitting. Oh, he oh, called he out the spot that so hard. He said, do it. No, he said, mine better. Oh my god, they're actually just brawling. And not the one with subspace. <laughs> well, let's get back here. I also like back air, because even if he like, cancels and shields there, like, exactly. back air is super safe. Yeah. Up smash gonna take it. I'm oh, not up smash, sorry, F smash. That was good. He up aired and waited out the air dodge. He did get the punish, but it was a good wait. If he had yeah. gotten another uh, up air there, he would have gotten a third. What is it? The patience. Oh. They're both so close to each other, but some of these moves just are not hitting, and it, <laughs> it makes me nervous. It's a good little piece of change. I'll be through the stage. Uh -huh. Yeah, it seems annoying, but those Razor Leafs really like that's, oh, yeah. that's your face control. That's how you deny exactly what he's trying to do to you. Dude, the upper was coming the out. the whole gameplay. Zard's out. He's like, you might not be scared of Ivy Dash attack, but... Uh, Sorry about this one. 
<laughs> about the foot. Yeah, that little dash back actually got Kamex a lot of... Oh <laughs> my god. What are you talking about? So he got called out on the spot dodge, and yeah. he just called out a jump like that. Quick 27% on the back throw there. 41 with an F tilt on top. Dash attack not going to hit. Spacing just a little too good. And F smash going to kill? That was spicy. Wow. Well, it was also like level level 3 rage, some angry, yeah. angry Zard. That, that Zard was upset. Chemex had one really good spot dodge call out yeah. with an F smash, and Noku retaliated with yeah. two, two smash attacks of his own, calling out a defensive option. He's like, I'm going to oh, tap you, you're going to air dodge the, in, and here's that. The that, flare blitz was yeah. the second. Oh, that flare blitz ball. He just threw it. He knew. Yeah, the little upbeat waterfall holding down. Ledge. Holding down so you don't grab ledge and you go past. Yeah, I swear, Squirtle not worth. Yeah. So is it Squirtle doesn't it just doesn't give you enough against Sonic. Too hard to Honestly, find. Honestly, I'd be I'd be swapping to Zard right now. The Zard proved to be very effective against Kamex. I think not at this low percent. He doesn't have like like uh, the ability to put on that much damage immediately. But now at yeah, this point it's a big for survival, to. yeah. Tech chase, he misses the tech, got a down smash off of it. Very good follow up. How's he gonna respond to spin dash though? It's kind of hard for Zard to a. Eh? Ooh, down Kill. smash not, not quite gonna go through. Flare Blitz, made it back to stage. It's back here not landing. He tried to up smash. He tried to catch Kamex uh, with an up smash there. Didn't quite work. Up smash was a good choice though, I can't fault him for it. It's just he was still barely active enough to hit him out of it. No. Oh, he caught him with the last hit in there. Pivot grab. Good back air, keeping up the aggression. Oh, I thought we were going to see the F smash charge. Yeah, that, that up air from my research is similar to what we were seeing from Solar last game, where it's like the, the jump at them, and then right before you touch the yeah. floor, uh, hit the up air. It's even cooler with Ivysaur because Ivysaur's up air like forces you into the ground. Ooh, that down air Speaking of getting forced into the ground. There was no ground to be forced into, my man. He got sent to the blast zone. He said, go down, bro. <laughs> what are you doing up here? The drop through ledge yeah. up there? Oh, we love it. We hard. love how safe that is. Like, Oh, yeah. You're in shield four days. Good tech, though. Tech in. Knew he wanted to go for the back air to send you off stage. Yeah, dude, ju jumping up and, uh, and up airing like from full hop on uh, with Ivysaur on uh, PS2 is almost the same as like wave landing. <laughs> oh, he gets uh, called up there in the back I, air, gonna trade with the looking nair. Looking at Ivy up air, I'm kind of upset they didn't go with rivals rules where the soft hit of it spikes. Uh, I think that would have been funny on a soft spike. But I understand why. Smash is a very different game. He actually sent. He actually sent the razor leaf in the wrong direction so that he could uh, prepare to back air there. Yeah. He just got called out a little too early. As long as Kamex doesn't do anything monumentally messed up, uh, it looks like we're going game five, though. I feel like this is really the slow it down and don't let anything weird happen. Yeah, just keep just keep grinding him out little by little. Slowly push him out. Keep it safe. Keep it, you know, tactical. This like is something weird. Yo, yep, I... I do not agree going that high. I'll say that going that high isn't inherently bad. But when you know that Noku's the kind of player to immediately capitalize on anyone standing above them with upbeat, then yes, I would definitely consider that you. I just think it was like the one thing he could have done better. to die in that situation. Uh, yeah. That's mad cheeky. This yep. little spin dash landing on him, pops him up, hits him with the back air. Yes, sir. All right, we're going game five, boys. Game five, we're not even at grands. I'm loving it. Actually, wait, let me check who we have. Who 
what it looks like we're going to have in Grant. Pretty sure it's Suarez and loses that. Uh, let's see, let's see. Let's Suarez and Gatsby. Suarez and Gatsby. Yeah. Right. So, like we said, Noku off to a quick uh, Ivy Star side. I think he yeah. realized that the. He realized the, the squirtle wasn't. wasn't working. Yeah, you were absolutely right on that. But Kamek seems to be ready for it. Did you see that? You saw that? Kamek's used the spin dash the spin, moving yeah, yeah. backward to play it at ledge like Ness Yo Yo. The cool thing about that, too, is uh, if he were to roll, he can spin dash at him because yeah. he's facing that dark. Exactly. Yeah. Noku really needs to answer this damage. Just little here. things like that, like, oh my god. I love seeing him use the weak spin dash, the like uncharged one, just to like be a hitbox. Oh, he read that, he called out that roll too, but he just wasn't quite fast enough on it. I actually like that he didn't go for the second up air there, because uh, the, the nair caused the shield poke. Yeah. Just barely missed oh. spacing that with the get up attack. Dash up F tilt got the sweet spot too. What more could you ask for? <laughs> he was waiting for that spot dodge again. Yeah. 155 on Zard. Does it go? Armored through it, like he said before. This is a the, very uh, scary Zard. Yeah. Back up. He's got the funny numbers. <laughs> oh my god, he really just is not dying. It's not uncommon to see Noku Zard live like yeah. 200. Yeah, this is that messed up. This is highway robbery. Yeah, no, you really need to, there, to close right, out those kills. Alright, okay. right, go Ivysaur immediately. Kamex. See, yeah, see, see, go Ivysaur immediately. Do not play Kamex, don't, Kamex, don't listen, don't listen. Like, Alright, look, look, look. Just slow it down a little bit, right? Dash start? No. He'd been using dash attack in that spot a lot where he goes for tech chase and it's like looking for a grab, but if you dash away and you're in your dash animation, he'll dash attack behind you. Yeah. Up and through that was actually Not really scary. Though. He he re grabbed there. He could have almost got hit by that uh, S smash. Alright, Zard's back out. What shenanigans shall we see with the Zard? He needs to rack on some percent here. He's has not done much since taking the last stock. Yeah. Oh, Ooh, that's back enough. Back here is gonna do it. He died at 74, man. Yeah. Pokemon trainer. Oh. Zard, am I right? <laughs>